New home construction communities coming soon to Las Vegas for 2021. And that's what I'm talking about today. So let's get started. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today, I thought it would be awesome to share with you guys the new home construction communities that will be hitting the Las Vegas market for this year. And there are 16 of them, 16 new home constructions. That's pretty awesome. You will be the first to know, and I have a list of all those new home communities. First to know. And you know why it's awesome to know beforehand? So you can get the finger on the pulse, so that you can be the first ones to inquire on that community, to register in that community, and also to hopefully get a home in that community. Why is it important to get a home in the very first release? One, you have a guarantee of that initial pricing because once they start releasing the next set of lots, there's always a price increase. So by the time this community is completed, you will have gained a lot of equity in your home. Now, if you're okay with choosing a lot that doesn't have views, but it's, it's a decent lot, then I say go for it. Do not wait out for the lot that has the best views or maybe the largest lot because one, you're gonna be paying a lot of money for that lot premium, and two, everyone else is gonna be wanting that lot as well. So again, the point of this video is to really educate you on the 16 new home communities. Most of them will be released this spring, and there is one this summer and one this fall. So I'm gonna go in order of, there's no particular order, it's just basically the ones that will be released in spring, summer, and then fall, and probably in alphabetical order of the builder. Couple things you need to know when you buy new home construction, and I say this every time I do a video on new home construction, is you need to hire a real estate agent to represent you. Why? Why is that important? Well, I have 14 deals under contract this year on new home construction, and my clients will tell you, it was worth having me represent them because there is so much involved when you're buying a new home. And it's not just about securing the lot. There's so many questions that you, as a new home buyer, may not think to ask because sometimes things just don't go accordingly. <laughs> um, you know, prime example is this one lady, I was talking to the, um, the construction manager at Lennar, one of my closings, and he said this lady was asking if he, they were closing but she used an outside lender. She didn't use the in-house lender provided by the builder. So of course, no one was communicating with anyone. And of course, the lender wasn't ready, so the house didn't close. It's important that you hire an agent that can communicate with all parties involved because you have the builder's agent, you have title escrow, you have the lender, you have the construction manager. There's a lot of hands involved in this one transaction and you need an experienced agent that knows what they're doing. But the caveat is in order to have a real estate agent represent you, they need to be with you on your very first visit. If they are not there, then you can forget about any representation because once you register, it's all over. And my advice in previous videos is if you are in town, you just wanna check out the community, but yet not committed to that community, then fill out a fake name on the registration form. That way, the next time you do come to the community with your real estate agent, they can represent you. Just food for thought on that. As an experienced new home sales agent, I've been through it all. And let me tell you, sometimes it's, it's a doozy. Anyways, let's get to the new homes that are coming for this year in Las Vegas. And the number one is Mont Rose Collection by Toll Brothers over in the Sky Canyon Village. And priced from the upper 400s located in 
the amenity rich and tranquil Sky Canyon Master Plan, the Montrose Collection is a private gated community offering single story home designs with three car garages and they also have a community pool. Sorry, I may be reading from this, but I also will attach some pictures of the community and the website as I go along. And this community is all gonna be single story, which is awesome. There's a lot of people that are looking for just single story homes. Um, we'll feature floor plans that range between 2,031 square feet to 2,370 square feet. Um, these new home designs come with a wide range of outstanding features, including 10 foot ceilings, eight foot interior doors, and plus homeowners will enjoy their own private community pool as well as access to the Sky Center and Sky Fitness in the Sky Canyon Park. So that's pretty awesome. Um, opening date has yet to be released, but they are now forming interest lists. I do believe actually this one will be hitting at the end of this month, which is March, um, if not the beginning of April. And I know they will not have the model homes ready until June. Toll Brothers is pretty well known for opening the models or opening the community prior to the models being completed. And I have created a blog post for this video, which will have a link to each of the communities. That way you can check out what the floor plans are and see if that's something that you like. Unfortunately, you probably will not be able to see any of the floor plans. From what I understand, a lot of these floor plans are new for Toll Brothers. Just FYI on that. So that is a hot seller. Single story, over 2,000 square feet with three car garages. This community is gonna sell very well. And it's in Sky Canyon. Kudos to Toll Brothers. Next is Heritage at Stonebridge by Lennar, which is in Summerlin. And it's an upcoming active adult community over in the Stonebridge Village. They're forming interest lists right now and prices and release date have yet to been released. Um, I do have quite a few clients that are interested in this community and I already know that that interest list is like really high and I know that there's going to be a lot of interest in this because the one cool thing about this community is that they're offering RV garages which is very hard to find anywhere in the Las Vegas Valley and I think a lot of builders need to get on board because a lot of people have RVs here. They look for communities where they can have RV parking. So this will be perfect for a 55 plus community. However, I don't know the pricing just yet or when it's gonna be released. I think sometime in April from what I understand from my clients. Heritage will present eight floor plans with three collections and ranging between 1232 to 2873 square feet. And all the homes and heritage features the Lennar Signature Everything Included package with many upgrades. One good thing I like about Lennar is the everything included package, which means, I don't know if the washer and dryer is gonna be included or the refrigerator, but unlike some other builders where you have to pick and choose, like if you wanted pre-wiring for fans, etc., all that comes with Lennar, which is pretty awesome. It's not an added expense. And Lennar's pricing is pretty reasonable as well. The bedrooms are gonna be two to three bedrooms and two to three bathrooms. And HOA fee is obviously $48 for Summerlin West. However, they have not released what the HOA fee is gonna be for living in that community. Another thing you gotta think about when you're buying a new home is actually the property tax. And property taxes on a new home is different than a resale home. And it's typically 1% of the total purchase price, meaning we have a base price, which includes your lot premium and then you also your upgrades. So whatever your total price is, including lot premium upgrades, it's gonna be 1% is your property tax. So if you buy an $800,000 home, 1% of that is obviously $8,000 and that's your new property tax. Obviously when you buy resale homes, the property taxes are a lot lower than that. So that's something to think about when you're buying new construction on the property taxes. And number three is landings at Cassia by KB Homes. And this is gonna be opening spring of 2021. This new community will be located in the southwest part of the valley off of Patrick Lane and South Buffalo. Pricing has yet to be released, go figure, because they don't wanna release those prices just yet. Because they may increase by the time they open this new community. <laughs> And they can do that right now. Um, they're gonna have four floor plans to choose from. And the square footage is gonna be between 1455 to 2469, all two-story homes. 
easy access to the I-215 and near shopping, dining, and entertainment. Then number four is reserves at Cassia by KB Homes. Again, opening spring of 2021. And this community is also located in the southwest part of the valley off of Patrick and South Buffalo. So how I interpreted this one is that the landings at Cassia and reserves at Cassia must be together because then this one has six floor plans with single and two story options. So they must be within the same area because they're both off of Patrick Lane and South Buffalo. But anyway, and again, pricing has yet to be released. Six floor plans to choose from, square footage between 1550 to 3066, single and two story homes. Again, easy access to the 215. Number five, then we have landings at Sage Glen, which again is opening in spring of 2021. This new community will also be located in the Southwest, but off of South Rainbow Boulevard and West Pebble Road. Pricing has yet to be released. There will be four floor plans to choose from, square footage between 1455 to 2469, all two-story homes, and again, easy access to the 215. Then you have the reserves at Sage Glen. Just like you had the landings and reserves at Cassia, now you have the reserves at Sage Glen, opening again in spring 2021. New communities located still in the southwest part of the valley on South Rainbow Boulevard and Pebble Road. This one has five floor plans to choose from, square footage between 1550 to 3066, and single and two-story homes. Again, easy access to the 215. So it sounds like these two communities, one in Cassie and Sage Glen, um, sounds like the, the homes are exactly identical, just little different parts of the southwest of the valley. And number seven is Archer by Lennar. And this new two-story home community is located in the beautiful northwest side of the valley off of O'Hare Road and Sunstone Parkway. Yay, O'Hare Road <laughs> and Sunstone Parkway. So I think Sunstone is a whole new, new master plan community that's going to be forming because there's other new homes that I'm going to be going over that are in the Sunstone area. Archer is close to recreational shopping opportunities as well as easy access to the US 95 freeway. Residents will enjoy beautiful master plan amenities such as parks, walking trails, bike trails, activity stations, and open spaces for year-round recreation. And again, Archer Homes features three beautiful two-story floor plans, one of which features Lennar's popular Next Gen, The Home Within a Home. Every home will be part of Lennar's Everything Included program, which includes amenities and features such as gourmet kitchen appliances, raised panel cabinetry, and all that home automation items. And then also, again, the gourmet kitchen appliances, which from what I understand, I have about eight homes selling by Lennar this year. Uh, they're all GE packages, unless you want to upgrade it to a more higher GE profile package, but they're pretty good appliances. They're really nice, actually. Um, and I like the Lennar Next Gen Home Within a Home. It's pretty awesome. They have one over at the Great Cliff Village called the Mahogany um, Next Gen Collection, and I really like having another Next Gen option because the way things are going right now, a lot of families moving in together, or parents moving in with their kids, or kids moving in with their parents, you have that next gen option. They're now taking reservations and pricing and opening date has yet to be released. Square footage is between 2472 to 2850, so set decent sized houses, two to three bedrooms, two and a half to three and a half bathrooms, and um, there's a special assessment of 5092, which is probably the HOA fee for that one. Not sure if there's gonna be SIDS on that community or not. Most communities that have SIDS are major master plan communities like Summerlin, a lot of the new communities in Henderson, and possibly Sky Canyon as well. Next is Aria at Sunstone by Lennar. And this will be all new single story homes in the northwest side of the valley, again, off of O'Hare Road and Sunstone Parkway. And it's gonna be close to all the same amenities as the other Archer at Sunstone, which is, you know, parks, walking trails, bike trails, activity stations, open spaces for year-round activities. The Aria home features two beautiful single-story floor plans, 
one of which features the Lennar's popular next-gen model and the everything included for Lennar, which we already went over. Again, now taking reservations and prices and opening date have yet to be released. The square footage is going to be between 1594 to 1760 square feet, three bedrooms, two to three bathrooms, and the assessment again on this one is $50.92, which is kind of a weird number. So we have to pay attention to that one. Number nine is Liberty by Pulte Homes. With innovative and customizable new homes in one of the city's most appealing Southwest neighborhoods, Liberty offers one, two, and three-story floor plans, thoughtful living spaces, and contemporary architectural styles. Nestled between Southern Highlands and Silverado Ranch area, Liberty is walking distance to schools and convenient access to the I-15 and 215 Beltway. There are gonna be five floor plans to choose from between two to six bedrooms, two to four and a half bathrooms, and two to three car garages. Again, prices and opening date have yet to be released. They are now forming interest lists for this one as well. So most of these communities have yet to disclose exactly when they will be released. We just know either they're coming spring, summer or fall, or just coming soon in general. And we have to guess and pay attention to it. That's why I created a blog post. You can keep an eye on the blog post with the links to each of these new communities so you can find out when it's going to be released. Number 10 is Seasons at Pewter Valley by Richmond American Homes. Are you searching for a home in a rural location with easy access to urban amenities? Look no further because Seasons at Pewter Valley offers inspired floor plans with versatile layouts, hundreds of structural design options, and close proximity to Las Vegas Boulevard and I-15. Enjoy everything that this new Las Vegas community has to offer. Opening date has yet to be released and they are now forming interest lists. There are gonna be no SID fees. Base price starting in the mid 300s. Wow, they announced a price. And square footage between 1470 to 1910. Bedrooms three to four. They didn't say how many bathrooms or car garages they had. I would imagine two to three bathrooms and only a two car garage. Number 11 is Summerstone Ranch by Richmond American Homes. And this is going to be coming soon to the northwest side of the valley off of Farm Road and Pulley Drive. Summerstone Ranch will be a gated community. No SID fees. Base price in the low 500s. Square footage between 2192, 2810, and bedrooms, three to five bedrooms. Again, the current theme, opening date has yet to be released, but at least they did release the pricing. Number 12 is Summerston Ridge, again, by Richmond American Homes, located in the same location as the previous one in the northwest side of the valley, off of Farm Road and Pulley Drive, Summerston Ridge is also another gated community, no SID fees, base price in the mid 400s, square footage between 1740 to 2150 with three to four bedrooms. They didn't tell me how many bathrooms or how many car garages, but you could expect probably two to three bathrooms and only two car garages, as I mentioned before. Number 13 is Hemingway Heights by Storybook Homes. And this is gonna be in the Southwest off of South Rainbow Boulevard and Rosanna Street. They will have single and two story homes, square footage between 1494 and 1840, three to four bedrooms and two bathrooms. Prices and opening date have yet to be released, of course. And number 14 is Trilogy Sunstone by Shea Homes. Set within the Sunstone Master Plan community is Trilogy Sunstone a brand new 55 plus retirement community offering resort style living in highly desirable Northwest Las Vegas. Uh, this new community is ideally located for outdoor adventures in nearby Red Rock Canyon, Mount Charleston, and Lee Canyon, while also offering quick access to excitement to the Las Vegas Strip. The 55 plus social hub of Trilogy Sunstone is planned to be a modern amenity rich resort club with stylish spaces designed to bring neighbors together. Um, 
So this is by Shea Holmes, which has the newest floor plans from their Freedom Collection. And it'll be like a duplex resort collection with a variety of home sizes and attractive prices ranging in the low 300s to the mid 500s. And they've got home designs that are certain to fit your lifestyle. They will you know, feature contemporary open concept floor plans, just like all the new homes do. But pre-sale starts in early spring 2021. So this should be opening really soon. I have another client that's interested in this community. They will be single family detached and duplex homes. Square footage between 1342 to 2579, two to four bedrooms and two to three bathrooms. They also will have a resort club there as well that will probably won't open for quite some time until the community is a little further developed. But that's another new 55 plus community coming to the Las Vegas Valley. So we have two now, which is Heritage at Stonebridge in Summerlin and now Trilogy Sunstone by Shea Holmes. So that's awesome. You know me. I love my 55 plus communities. Now the next one's coming summer 2021 and it's Verbena by Beezer Homes. And this is located just one mile west of Henderson and will feature a popular collection of spacious two story floor plans. Pricing has yet to be released. I think this is gonna be in the 89122 zip code. So it's, it's close to Henderson, but not part of Henderson. Includes choice plans, room options at no cost, spacious rear yards, community park with tot lot, easy access to Boulder Highway and I-515. Um, I'm not too familiar with Beezer Homes. Actually, I've never sold a Beezer home and I've never been in a Beezer home. So uh, that's kind of interesting. I need to actually do my diligence and, and check out Beezer, right? And number 16 is Sunstone by Woodside Homes. Sunstone will be coming fall of 2021 and it's the newest master plan development in the Northwest which, you know, we've gone over a couple of communities that are in the Sunstone community. Woodside Homes will build over 627 new home ownership opportunities throughout the three gated communities within the Sunstone Master Plan community. So I need to investigate exactly what the Sunstone is gonna be and do a video on it for you guys so we can educate ourselves, right? And it's in the Northwest. I love the Northwest side of the valley. Two neighborhoods will consist of two-story homes ranging approximately 1,600 to 2,700 square feet, while the third neighborhood will feature all single-story designs so close to Mount Charleston and Lee Canyon area. This master plan will offer the opportunity with boundless adventure. It's kind of exciting. What do you think of the 16 new home constructions that will be coming to Las Vegas for 2021? I just can't imagine that there is going to be new homes, but obviously we need the new construction because of our very low inventory. Um, and I'm glad to see that they're scattered throughout the valley. Southwest, Northwest seems like there's gonna be new homes there. Of course, now I did not cover the Henderson area because video states all new home constructions in Las Vegas for 2021. Henderson is a whole nother city and not part of Las Vegas as I say this over and over again. So maybe I will look into Henderson and maybe I'll get a video out on it. Never know. Leave a comment down below if any of these new home construction communities interest you or if you wanna learn more about them and I need to do a video on it. Anyways, if you're thinking about buying a new home this year, you know who to call, right? Me, Angelo Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor at 702 three seven zero five one one two or i've posted a link to a buyer form down in the description below you need an agent that's experienced in selling new homes i have 14 new homes just this year i know what i'm doing <laughs> anyways if you like this video you know what to do right hit that thumbs up button leave a comment down below share with a friend and smash that subscribe button because I like to talk about Las Vegas neighborhoods a lot. I like to think that I know something about them. Thank you so much for watching, and I cannot wait to see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.